friends, our opportunity for victory will come. But first, we must see to our defenses. The city's defenders are trying to stall for time. We must crush them swiftly. We should be wary of ambushes as well. Vladislava is being pushed on the left flank. We must push back with equal force. Stay focused. Oh, look, I can do this. Each battle, a chance to grow. Put me in there. Wait. Just what we need. I knew Her Majesty's allies would help us out. Yeah. Didn't know that was a thing. Well, no one wasted that me. guy. I'm impressed. Ferdinand von Eyer. Good spear, but I'm not having him waste it. As you wish. I will get the victory. That's my cue. Kill him. Interesting. And you're soaking up my experience. Please stop it. Got to use you for a couple of turns. Let's get you in some of this action. For Lady Edelgard. Smack. Well, how was that? Still a long Ooh, that bow is getting empty. I should have repaired that, I think. Am I done yet? Oh, just barely missed it. my way, jerkwads. Let's save that for a more usable time. <laughs> it didn't even do damage to a, a freaking magic unit.
Oh. Now, hidden soldiers, attack! <laughs> this is not. How does I want to do this? Yeah. Unfortunately, it's a special case. Let's use the good weapon. You should never have defied the goddess. Really? You couldn't crit now when it would have been nice with a forty percent chance. Myself to fall here. You will survive this hardship. Just hold on. Allow me to Yay, that helped. You're making me look bad. Partially deal with her, but eh. Okay, so you deal with the heavy armored guy. How humiliating. You deal with this guy. Just the one shot him. You are not. Hey, she got a level. That was what a mage did to an armor class. Practically nothing. job good job actually stay focused here we go I will get the victory. Hey, you're, you're annoying. But you're gone. Protect Garrick Mock. I must protect everyone. I never trained you. Why were you so strong all of a sudden? 
Retreat while you still can, Flame. I beg you. Understood. Stay safe, uh, brother. Hey, it's the Death Knight. Don't worry, we're allies now. I understand you must. That's my cue. Boom. I've got many skills, you know. As you wish. For Lady I don't know why I skipped that, but I did. Whatever. Oh no. I will prevail. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. Sure, I one shot it. The mark of ninety sixed it. Hey, you can cake his a uh, master class. Hey. Oh crap, I forgot to unequip that. 156 damage. Now I can do so her because she took a big chunky hit but she fought uh what's her name flying appreciate it no one's dying Hey, double level. Nice. This is what a real What? Oh yeah. No, that's not the no, that does. Why is he not? I see. I will show no mercy to anyone who attacks Rhea. Eat this then. I cannot yield. Flame, Gilbert, you put your lives on the line to protect us. I would have preferred to have more time to prepare, but we cannot delay any longer. Come forth. Protect Garrick Mock Monastery from those despicable rebels. Oh yeah, I forgot those things showed up. And she shows up. I'll crush them all. enemies are my enemies the 
they base attack off magic, so... Italian Wrath. What's attacking him? Ah. Okie dokie then. Where are you going? Well, he's dead. You did nothing to me. And you went off your long distance thingy. You and half. Yeah, it worked. Dance. Let's chop this girl in half. No one makes it past me. with one ballista. Should I have held back? Do not incur the wrath of Catherine. <laughs> hey, perfectly timed crit. Screw you, Cyril. Eat a meteor. I couldn't fight hard enough. I'm sorry. Soon, your sacrifice will not be in vain. Is he, just, is he dead there, or did he retreat? I can't remember. Yes, plan is flawless. We'll Get this one's armor out of the way.
These things drop mithril! <laughs> And then she should be able to finish it off here. Yep. I gotta make sure I break the other one next round. On Caspar, move farther. Yeah. I think she just barely hit that level cap there. It's just... Yeah, you gotta be careful with her, because she's kinda crazy. I just wanna hear what this is. Ah, I can still do this. Perfect. Only one. Ah. And finish it off. And get him a level. Nice. Any experience. Thirty for her, but I never advance her to a master class, so whatever. Yeah, I'm gonna save that. Like. That's my cue. Battle. You can get a better per person that needs a better heal. Stay focused. And not in range of, uh, Catherine! Ooh. 
If anyone get in range of her is you attack her, huh? As expected. No, oh, Death Knight killed that guy. Yeah, let's just see if this works. And I will slay all of Lady Rhea's enemies, including you. No, I'll just nuke you. I'm sorry. Please stay safe. All is well, Catherine. You must not die here. I will get the victory. Put me in there. Here we go. Actually, just heal him. Thanks for helping. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. As you wish. As you I don't want to heal her because she's stronger when she's missing HP. <laughs> Yeah, 33, for no reason. Yeah, training axe. Could have. Um, the bots can't kill this thing. So who's taking out Rhea? I am Ferdinand von Eyer. That's my cue. That's all you can do. Put me in there. Here we go. Here we go. 
I wonder if they had a line they could say to each other. Stay focused. That's my cue. I will get the victory. And goodbye. So you have sullied yourself by joining the rebels? I hope you came prepared to breathe your last. Cheeky little bitch. I will not allow Garrick Mock or my mother to fall. Well, you just did, so... Hey, everyone's motivation increased. You will not be forgiven! Perfection, look out! The castle is crumbling! We must escape! Professor, take cover! Professor! Couldn't even give us the movie for that like the other routes get, huh? Then it gets the same movie, so... Oops. And I keep dropping my phone like a moron. I thank you so much. In Imperial Year 1181, the new Adrestian Emperor, Edelgard von Hressfeld, led a strategic assault against the monastery at Garrig Mach. Though her own losses were great, her foes had no choice but to surrender. Archbishop Rhea commanded the Knights of Seros, leading from the front lines against the Imperial Army. After a hard-fought battle, she was forced to retreat to Ferdiad, the capital of Fargus, where she must now plan her next move. Curse you, Dimitri. Attack, the Adrestian Empire officially launched its offensive against the Holy Kingdom of Fargus and the Lester Alliance. The unification of Odland has begun. Wow, save, watch a small cutscene save. Gotta love that. Part 2 Crimson Flower Ethereal Moon Beyond Escape. Beyond Escape. It is Imperial Year 1185. Half a decade has passed since Emperor Edelgard ascended the Imperial throne. Yet the continent of Fodlin still remains lost in a tempest of turmoil and bloodshed. In the Holy Kingdom of Fargus, King Dimitri has welcomed Archbishop Rhea and her knights, who were driven out of Garrick Mach to the kingdom capital. As they work to build a unified front, the war with the Empire rages on to the west. Meanwhile, Claude, leader of the Alliance, staves off Imperial intervention by strategically stirring up conflicts between Lester lords in an effort to feign neutrality. Yes, feign As neutrality. As unfold, Edelgard and her Black Eagle strike force begin to take action in an attempt to break the war's current state of deadlock. And save another loading screen. <laughs> you. How long do you intend to sleep? Though so my alarm gets annoying. Your body is awake. Your eyes must open now, and you must find the strength to stand upon those legs of yours. Like so much rain, a pool of blood has fallen to the ground. As spears and arrows pierce the earth, it weeps. And even now, it weeps. In order to survive, they kill. 
and kill or be killed. People of this world are lost in an abyss of suffering. They weep as well. The only one who truly knows the nature of such things is I. Or rather, you. Excuse me? Are you saying you have forgotten who I am? How dare you? <laughs> Get on your feet. Right now. I'll coddle you no more. You are just like a child, always needing me to hold your hand. Hey, are, are you awake? Where am I? We're in a village at the base of the monastery. What are you doing in a place like this? I honestly didn't expect to find someone floating away down the river. Garrick Mach is upstream of here, but that place was abandoned. You mean... Huh? You don't know? The Church of Saros isn't there anymore. Though, there have been some folks still living there in the five years since... Well, you know. Regardless, the Imperial Army has taken over now. What year is it? Um, are you feeling alright? You didn't hit your head or anything, did you? It's the Ethereal Moon, the year 1185. It's been nearly five years since the monastery fell. Tomorrow was supposed to be the Millennium Festival, but who's got time to think about things like that? The Millennium Festival? Uh, yeah, that's what I said. But with the war and the Archbishop still missing and all, I doubt there's a soul to be found who has enough blessings worth counting. Hey, slow down, will ya? Where do you think you're going? The monastery? Are you crazy? The Imperial Army is there. Come on, I promise I won't say you're a coward. Just forget about going anywhere near the monastery. You that was didn't bother recording a different line because she's technically not it's missing not in this timeline. My students are waiting students. for me. You really are crazy, aren't you? There aren't any kids anywhere near that place anymore. Unbelievable. Five years ago to the day. If things had continued on as they were, today would have been the Millennium Festival. Halt! Who's there? It can't be. Professor? Is it really you? But I searched everywhere and never found a trace. My teacher. What have you been doing all this time? Where have you been? I was sleeping. Joking? At a time like this? You do realize it's been five years since you disappeared. Do you have any idea how guilty I felt? How broken my heart was? I searched high and low after you vanished. Although there was All no right. proof, I somehow knew you were alive. All hey, Aces, time, thanks for the raid. As best I could, and fought with Your stream went a little less than it usually did today. To usually the other way around, I raid you. <laughs> Welcome back, my teacher. I'm so happy that you're safe. Well, I just I got to the war in this game about the... Time. Well, normally the halfway point for the other routes, but this one, it's a little bit shorter. So. You did all those years ago. You so there was a time skip. Fight at my side, no matter how many enemies we should amass. As for me, my resolve has not faltered. I'm determined as ever to see this through to the end. I will defeat the false goddess. I will save this world from those creatures and give humanity its freedom back. So, my teacher... Are you prepared to stand with me? I am. I had no other choice, but... I thank you. Truly. Now then, I assume you understand the situation at hand, yes? I really was asleep all this time. Another joke. Or... Are you telling the truth? I suppose you must be. In that case, I'll tell you all that has transpired as you slumber these past five years. And that is where we are now. The war is at a stalemate. Dimitri is the new... Yeah, king I've had a few. It's clear that his territory will continue to support the church. Meanwhile, Claude's leadership has thrown the alliance into chaos. 
He maintains neutrality in their internal. It was nice for that week and a half they were gone. <laughs> We've been awaiting an opportunity for our squadron to return to the monastery. With you in the fray, I believe the state of the war will shift immediately. And you're not wrong. As well as the kingdom and the alliance. The time has come to eliminate them all. I've already banned them all, so, but unless you've, uh... No. It's basically, uh, that, then ban, then the name. It's not letting me put it, but it's... Come on. Yeah, just backslash ban the name, so... Church of Seros. The knights and the others are in prime condition. They've set up their base within the kingdom capital. The Immaculate One and her family have yet to fight on the front lines. However, we must eventually face and defeat them. It would mean a great deal to have you with us when the time comes. Good. Well then, I believe it's time for a little reunion. Yay, the reunion. The Force never lost faith. <laughs> They knew you were alive and have been awaiting your return. Let's not keep them waiting any longer. Yeah, I already banned them all. <laughs> I had a little cutscene thing where I could do it quick. Combat forecast. Yuritsa will now work together with you. Well now, that face is certainly familiar. I am glad to see you alive and well, Professor. I can't Oops. believe it. Is this a dream? Can we really be this lucky? This is not dreaming. Our Professor is with us again. And everyone has a new look. I mean, welcome back. Our group isn't the same without you. I am overjoyed to see you again. It's been so long. Seeing you again fills my heart with hope. Great. Now everything will be easy. Um, that's great you're safe, Professor. I'm deeply, deeply moved. Quite the reunion, isn't it, Professor? Everyone's happy to see you. Come on, Edelgard. You must be happier than all of us combined. She took it really hard when you disappeared, Professor. <laughs> of course, we did our very best in your absence, and there was never a day that we doubted you would return to us. Edelgard has been leading us as Emperor. But after you disappeared, it became apparent that you were her anchor. It gives me And you couldn't do anything without me for five years. Our power is not enough. The only one who can be meeting Edelgard's expectations is you, Professor. Most impressive of all is your uncanny ability to bring a smile to everyone's face. In the years since you vanished, we have not lost anyone from our ranks. We all longed for your presence and your leadership, myself included. It seems fitting to view this as a new beginning for the Black Eagle Strike Force. We already have our target. Yes, we must eliminate the Alliance before moving on to fight the Kingdom and the Church. However, that doesn't necessarily mean we must occupy the entirety of the Alliance. House Regan stands against the Empire. Therefore, our target is Deirdre, the aquatic capital. We must cross the Aramid River, which separates the Empire and the Alliance. To do that, Cut off the head, the, and the body dies. It. The Great Bridge of Murden. Murden connects the Monastery and the Imperial capital to the east. It is the shortest route there. An Alliance stronghold has been built at the Great Bridge. We'll take that and then head north. At the same time, we must defeat the one who defends it, Judith von Daphne. If we can also take control of Daphne territory, it would be greatly beneficial to us. Prepare yourselves. The next battle will be a momentous one. Join me, my friends, as we begin our journey to bring peace and solace to this war-ravaged world. A war which you started.
And I'm just gonna get loads and loads of support conversations. Since I left home. Since I was dragged out of the house, I mean. Five whole years. It's weird to think about. Weird in what way? At first, I remember I was desperate to go back, but now it's the opposite. I have friends here, and I have you. The monastery's become a second home to me. Back then, I never would have dreamed a day like this would come. I'm happy for you. It's all thanks to you. You've given me a second chance at life. If not for you, I never would have gotten used to leaving my room, let alone the monastery. Maybe the battlefields just dulled my senses. I'm much better with strangers and new places now, though. I don't panic nearly as much as before. You go somewhere new by yourself? A new place? All on my own? That sounds like a tough assignment. Where did this come from all of a sudden? Hey, hold on. You're teasing me, aren't you? Please don't joke around like that anymore. It's torture for me. All right, all right. You're still not taking me seriously. I mean it. Promise me you won't do that again. Friends respect each other's feelings, don't they? Okay, I promise. Good. I'll hold you to that. You're absolutely not allowed to send me out anywhere on my own. Got it? You would need to come with me. If you're with me, I can go anywhere in the world. Hmm. I'll follow at a distance. No, that defeats the purpose. Why can't you get what I'm saying? Oh, that's enough. I need some time alone. <laughs> Why not? Singing is nice, isn't it? The only thing is... Hmm. I I remember what she says audience. during these. Our voices are all over the place. We must learn to work together in harmony. Harmony. Explore the monastery. My god. All <laughs> I have so many support conversations. I like her hair like that better. And everyone got a little bump up in level. My first time getting him. Murderous intent. Hit plus 20%. Give him that, because why not? And a cheap lance. And I have never heard a single one of these support conversations before, so I have no idea what any of them are about. Because I have to finish that one off with her quick.
Okie dokie then. Gonna be lazy. Let's see who I get. Professor. Hubert, why not? Nice place, isn't it, Professor? Standing here, you can almost feel the goddess's absence. Discounting what dwells within you, of course. Just about to say. Punishment would rain down from the sky if this monastery were to be destroyed. Of course not. Even if the so-called Immaculate One came back here for revenge, that would only be a result of this war. Not the work of a deity. Blunt is always. If you hate the goddess? Love and hate, then I would choose the latter. The goddess failed to properly govern this world. That is why it is necessary for Lady Edelgard to become the supreme leader of Fodlan. Those with power must use it wisely. Is that not a teaching of the Church of Seros? It's absurd to preach to others what you cannot practice yourself. Sometimes it's necessary. That is logical, but I am afraid your logic is informed by your humanity. That is not the case for inhuman creatures with lifespans well beyond our own. We must fight to preserve what makes us human. You are the one closest to the enemy. I wonder if you will be able to maintain your humanity to the end. I'm unable to. Does that mean you know I will do what must be done? Yes. You trust me a great deal. <laughs> I've already dedicated my life to Lady Edelgard. To throw my lot in with you is inconceivable. But if I had two lives to give, I might devote one of them to you. We could be a couplet of birds flying alongside the Sovereign of Black Eagles. I think this one's a little bit different if you're playing as a male avatar, if I recall. Oh, because that was the actual A one. How many do I have with her? One, two, three, four, five. Hmm. survived how very fortunate were you dead i wouldn't be able to fight you but you are very much alive now i have a chance to kill you <laughs> need to work on her lance Hello. Let's see what kind of visitors we got today. Gimza. Whatever, I'll buy it. We see. Whatever, I'll buy it. I'm being nice. Ooh, that's actually worth buying. Brave bows are nice. Whatever, I'll buy a bullhead. Four person recon. Right. Hmm. A moment. Hmm. This one's not going well if I haven't found one person. 
that soon. And everyone has so little faith in me, just no, no, no. I got this. Hey. Hey. Hmm. Hey, I got it. I did it. Found all three people. Oh, basically everyone just lost every ounce of their motivation. <laughs> right, right. Phase through wall, phase through door. There is one note. What do you have to say, because... After the battle five years ago, the Imperial Army occupied Garrig Mach. The cathedral and several other buildings were destroyed, but we've done some repair work here and there, and we're using the buildings as a base of operations. As for me, well, the church moved its headquarters to Fargus, and I've seen no reason to follow. When I returned to Enbar, I received a summons from Her Majesty, and I chose to answer. Hey. I'm so surprised to hear that the faith of Saros was a sham. My eyes nearly popped out of my skull. But just because the church lied to us doesn't mean that the goddess... Yes, she has those. That's my take on it anyway. I feel very anxious with no one to pray to. Who, me? Then pray to me, for I am the goddess reborn. Yeah, she does have a pair of those, doesn't she? Might as well do this. I'll keep my voice down. Singing is nice, isn't it? The only thing is, I'd prefer to do. Ooh, shiny blue thing. Owl feather. Let's see who this support conversation's with. Professor. Mercedes. I need to speak with you. Not yet. Thank you so much. This is what I wanted to address. A letter. This letter from my adopted father just arrived. Adopted father? Oh, have I not mentioned him? He's the reason I first came to the Officers Academy. He's also the one who dragged me from the church where I was living, just so he could use my crest. What a jerk. This does not yet belong to a house, so he plans to use it as leverage to marry into the nobility. He's a very greedy man who was a roving merchant before adopting me, but now he's in the capital. This letter says that he's finally arranged to marry me off to a wealthy noble. <sighs> I know he's just thinking of himself, but can't he see that this isn't a priority when we're at war? My thoughts exactly. What to do about this proposal? Will you accept? I can't see any way around it, so I fear that I must. I just don't want to let go of the life that I've made for myself. I know it's not what my heart wants, but I don't have the strength to say no. 
What does your heart want? I believe I've mentioned this before, but I want to work in service of the church. Well, I suppose it doesn't necessarily have to be the church, but I want to help those in need. If I were to marry a noble, I think it would be difficult to realize that dream. Yeah, they didn't really change this for having her come along with the Black Eagles. It's just... I've always allowed myself to follow the whims of those above me. I convinced myself that everything in life was at the will of the goddess. I was blind to reality. I believed it was her will to both pull me from the church and guide me to the officer's academy. The decision to enter this war was the first time I acted of my own free will. My adoptive father opposed this decision, but I somehow managed to convince him. Still, I couldn't free myself of him completely. <laughs> this letter is proof of that. It's not that I'm scared of him, but there is something that worries me. Severing your ties? Ah, I knew you'd understand, Professor. I've sat down to write a reply several times, but I can't muster up the courage or the words. I was hoping you could provide me with the encouragement I need. Tell him the he F off. Why reply at all? If I don't, he'll go ahead with the arrangement. I suppose I must aim toward cutting him out of my life completely. Okay. I think that may have been just the push I was looking for. I'll tell him the truth. That I found a life worth pursuing, and I must decline the proposal. Maybe I should tell him I've fallen for someone else. <laughs> Who might that be? Why, it's you, Professor. Isn't that obvious? I wouldn't say obvious. <laughs> I'm just teasing. Now I'm off to write this letter and stand my ground. Thank you for your encouragement. Let me check something if I'm remembering right here. No, he's not lying. One of the uh, three or four. You know, one of the f no, three uh, women in the game that you can have the S tier like marriage thing at the end of it. Yeah, it's Mercedes, Dorothea, and Edelgard you can do that with. But anyway, I'm getting tired. I gotta kind of work early tomorrow, so I am going to call it here for the night.